His imagination, absolutely fantastic. He's just intuitively creative. A plain, down-to-earth person who respected everybody. He is perfect. A good scout. He was a role model of a scout. That's why he was, he became a leader. Well, I was uh, born in Ukraine, a town of Zhokwa near Lviv, western Ukraine. This was Poland at that time. Finally, after the war finished, we were in a uh, displaced person camp in uh, Munich. And we started searching for our relatives who lived in Canada. Uh, we located them in, uh, in Thorhild, uh, outside of Edmonton. During those turbulent years, we have uh, learned that you can lose everything in life, but you won't lose education. Education, with education, you can do wonders. You can climb to the heights. And Lou's dream was to be somebody. And he was a born leader. He was very uh, demanding from himself. I think his greatest influence comes from scouting. His character, you know, his curiosity. Once hiking in the mountains, you know, we were lost. And I said, we are lost. And he says, no, we are not lost. We are here. But the trail is lost. We have to find the trail. He could put it some other way. Not that I expected. The UFA gave me a lot of good training in thinking. Professor Govier used to tell us that uh, if you can see that your research will lead to paying your job and at least 10 or 100 other jobs, it's worth working on it. But if it's going to be only for a publication, do it if the government is paying for it. <laughs> University of Alberta was going to offer me a position in material sciences department to a, a professorship, but I had to wait for a year. And for me to wait for a year was just not practical, so I started looking for jobs in U.S. and I landed about 16 jobs of which uh, IBM was one of them. I started working on thin film heads and the first inductive heads turned out to be very, very successful. Every desktop, every laptop, every major computer has many, many of them because it stores all the information. So for 33 years, every company in the world has been using the basic technology that I've at that time invented. Nobody was even pursuing it. People were trying to accomplish the same objectives, but nobody had taken this path. Luby is now working on thin film solar technology. Uh, these are thin film solar cells that are um, can be put on either glass, a rigid substrate, or on metal foil, which is uh, flexible. And I said, why don't you get married? And I knew at that time that he had many good prospects, professional ladies, you know, beautiful ladies that were after him. I was not afraid, he says, but I had no time. Don't follow the path you know, wherever it may lead, he said. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. <laughs>